from a use case perspective, you know, there's nothing exotic going on with NWDAF. Um, you know, there's actually going to be a wide range of use cases envisioned for NWDAF in the various 3GPP releases. But, you know, it starts with monitoring the network, what's going on with performance and load and congestion and detecting anomalies and making sure, you know, QoS is sustainable for users and looking at what's going on with device behavior, whether that's mobility or communication patterns or abnormal usage that you'd like to detect. Um, and then kind of rolling up that information to essentially a view of service experience um, and developing metrics that monitor service experience and not just for human users. I mean, 5G is going to be different because I think we're going to see a lot of machines relying on the network and we're going to need to quantify service experience, you know, on behalf of the machines that that might not be in a position to speak up like a human would. So, you know, NWDAF, um, it's a new thing from a uh, standardization perspective, but you know the, the uses for it are going to be all the things that any mobile network operator is going to care about. 